little crop tour. It's uh, June uh, 18th. So this is our corn we planted uh, June 9th. <clears throat> uh, it's looks pretty good. It's the first time I've been out here actually. Um, it's been sprayed, fertilized. Everything's done. It's, of course, it's around our uh, calf sheds. So more rain coming again. That's all it does is rain, but. The corn is looking, looking nice. Uh, we did spray uh, liquid nitrogen on with our chemicals, um, <clears throat> so we'll see how that, how it looks in, in um, a week or so. But uh, I've seen corn everywhere from poking out of the ground to uh, a knee higher or better. Um, this all depends on where you were, and it doesn't matter. A couple miles, <clears throat> um, mile down that way, it looks better. But anyway, what um, I'm just uh, double, double chicken out here. Uh, Dad is uh, the 966 uh, <clears throat> broken uh, exhaust stack and all, uh, screaming, uh, chisel plow and well slash fuel coating. Because as you guys know, uh, we have a nine shank chisel plow that we put uh, put uh, 16 inch uh, sweeps on it, so that covers the whole. The whole uh, array of it. So we basically used it as a chisel plow, or not a chisel plow, as a fuel culvert. And we ran it at four or six inches deep. And we're pulling a 5R John Deere Harrow behind it, which our Harrow is about wore out by now because we've been doing a lot. But what we're going to see out here is uh, is taff, taff grass, and um, it's a uh, warm season uh, annual grass like Timothy. This is, uh, we had winter rye out here. This is, uh, and we had oats last summer. Uh, this is where we kind of run some of our, uh, our bread heifers, because it's uh, next to a uh, timber uh, where they can go down and get a drink in the winter time. But um, it's, a, it's uh, four acres, three and a half acres. Uh, should have planted it to corn, but just didn't get, it's just too late. So we're gonna put teff grass in here. Um, which I alluded to in my video uh, yesterday, the other day. Um, so we're gonna put, do that. So he's gotta tear this up. We did, I did disc this um, earlier, like a month ago now, probably. Uh, but the cows did uh, graze the, the winter eye off and, and stuff. Uh, so, and then right now all it is is weeds. So. We're gonna, he's gonna tear that up uh, once or twice. Um, I'll just show you kind of a, what it kind of does. But this is, was disc once <clears throat> and then running this magic machine. Um, everybody has their fancy uh, tillage machines. <clears throat> That's what it looks like. It's a little cloudy, probably because it's a little damp, but it's level and it's even. Um, we'll see how it goes because we're trying to bury grass. Then so what we're gonna do? I'm, actually, after look at this, I'm gonna have him maybe maybe do it twice. We'll see. I'll let him go a couple more rounds. And then we're gonna call the packet with the call the mulcher, and then we're gonna put the uh, the uh, cedar on the uh, four wheeler. And we're gonna seed our tough grass because you only want that stuff to like a quarter inch deep. So you can hear the nine scream, but um, she likes to work. So then we're gonna fly the uh, tough grass on, and then we're gonna call the packet. So, so that'll be the videos to come. Uh, we'll let uh, Dad go around. Uh, I have a turn more. You guys can listen to the old our workforce. Uh, she spent cow this morning. Now she's uh, tearing ground up, um, and she's got a haul in order tonight. And what? 
on jinx it myself. Uh, hope she don't break, but um, she likes to work, and she works. And then dad's giving her hell. So uh, anyway, and then my helpers are like, um, okay, we'll take a break. So anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, catch the next video. Uh, uh, we'll be uh, probably uh, running the cold mulcher out here. Uh, which is a new thing for us. Uh, we borrowed it from a neighbor, but uh, we'll see you guys next time. Subscribe if you haven't, and questions, comments, all that YouTube stuff as always. And uh, we'll see you guys next time.